Hey, what's going on, Samurais, and welcome to today's video. Today, I want to talk about live streaming. To be exact, I want to talk about how to connect your camera or your video switcher to your computer for live streaming. But before I do that, if you guys are brand new around here and you're checking out my channel for the first time, make sure you go down and click that subscribe button. We would love to have you join our familia. If you guys do like today's video and you want to see more content like this, make sure you show me by smashing that thumbs up button. If you have any questions about anything I'm talking about today, make sure you ask them in the comments section below. So today we're going to be talking about how to connect your video switcher or your camera to your computer for live streaming. Now there's tons and tons and tons of devices out there that can do this and they're at all different price points. Some are $50, some are $2,000 and I've tried and I own and I've used several of these devices and my all time favorite way to do this is to use the Elgato Camlink, this little bad boy right here. Basically what it is, it's a HDMI to USB dongle. So all you need to do is plug your camera, your video switcher in on this end, and then stick it into your computer and you're up and running one, two, three. It's a very easy to use device. Now there is one little caveat before buying this device. You need to check to make sure it works with the camera and streaming software you are using. And the easiest way to do that, even though Elgato on their website has cameras listed, uh, when I went there though, my cameras weren't listed. So what I did, and I recommend you guys should do this too, is pick up the phone, call Elgato, be like, hey, I'm using this camera, I'm using this computer, and I'm using this software. Will the cam link work with it? That's the best way to check to make sure you're gonna be guaranteed that when you purchase it, it will work for you. All right, guys, let me show you exactly how to set everything up right now. All right, so like I said before, it's very easy to set up the cam link. All you need to do is take your HDMI cable, plug it into your dongle, and then plug this into your computer. All right, let's hop over to the computer so I can show you the rest of the steps from there. To show you guys how to set up the cam link, I am going to use OBS Studios, which is a free streaming software. If you guys want to check it out, I will put a link in the description below. Now, basically the cam link appears just like a regular webcam would appear on your computer. So all you need to do is come over to video capture devices, click on it once, open up your cam link, and you will see I appear one, two, three, I click okay, and now I'm in my little screen on my video. So it's very simple to connect your cam link for live streaming to your computer. So one quick side note, there are some system requirements to be able to operate the cam link on your computer. Now I'm running on a Mac. If you guys are using a PC, they're gonna be different. So I do recommend you go to the Elgato website before purchasing this and check out the system requirement page. I will put a link to that in the description below. So the cam link is a great device, especially for people trying to start live streaming on a budget. So if you are a brand new gamer and you're trying to stream to Twitch, or maybe you're a vlogger and you wanna be able to connect more with your audience by doing live streams to Facebook Live or YouTube, this is the perfect device for you. All right, Sam Rice. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to check out more information about the Elgato cam link, I will put a link in the description below. If you guys like today's video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. If you're new around here, make sure you go click that subscribe button. If you have any questions about anything I talked about in today's video, make sure you ask them in the comment section below. And let's say it all together. Remember to dream big, think bigger, and always be you. I love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.